Hello, Twan. This is Russell with the Piano Outlet, and uh, I made this video for you today in order to show you what your piano is going to look like and sound like when you get it. I want to first play it for you so you can hear what it sounds like with me playing it, and then I'm going to work it with the iPad so you can hear what it sounds like with the iPad. And then show you some of the little things that we're going to do to it uh, before it goes out, some leftover things. Uh, we do have to regulate it one more time, give it a tuning. Uh, we want to regulate it so that all the keys operate the same so that when it works with the player system, it plays nice and even. Uh, everything is uh, up to factory spec. And then uh, also give another tuning. And these pianos come in, sometimes they come in a half a step flat, and we need to give it maybe three or four tunings so they get nice and stable. <coughs>
piano sounds like now. I just want to tell you some of the things, the little details that we do to really make the piano stand out from a lot of other pianos that might be used that uh, you might not notice. And some of the things that we do that we did the other day is that we took each key and we cleaned in between so that when you see the wood on either side, see when somebody's sitting and playing the piano, you don't really see that. But when the piano's playing by itself, you see in between all the keys. And what happens is that through the years they get black in here. So we had to take each key out and we cleaned it. We actually very lightly sanded it so it looks brand new when you go into the piano. The other things that we do that a lot of people leave out is when we do the pedals, we take the pedals completely out of the piano, we polish them, and we install them back. That was already done. Uh, so some of the things that we still have to do, like on the inside of the piano, um, we want to take these hinges off and we want to polish them, make sure the screws are nice and shiny. Um, we polish the inside of every one of these screws, get polished. Uh, we can't do this work when the piano's getting the player system because the piano's up on its side. So since the piano was just completed this, this past week, and now it's set up here, we want to tune it. This does go out of tune when we do the installation. And, uh, and then that gives us the opportunity before it goes out to do a lot of the detail work, which on the inside is clean these bolts, polish them, so they look nice and shiny, and polish the duplexes, so these look nice and shiny. So when you get the piano, everything looks new inside. We'll even polish and clean the strings some more. And then some of the other things, we even take these screws out one by one and we polish the tops, but we also clean out the inside because what happens is that if you polish these screws, you get dirt and uh, you get compound inside the screw, so you get a nice shiny head but black inside. But we take a little, little detail brush and we go inside each screw and make sure that the insides of the screws are polished out as well. So what we want the piano to look like when it's finished is that this looks like jewelry, basically. And so we do that. Um, and then on the inside here, what else we're going to do <coughs> is we polish and we clean all of the, the pins and also the egg graphs here. These are going to be bright and shiny and it's going to look like, again, I like to use the term jewelry, you know, nice, uh, brightly polished gold. And that really sets off everything as far as the look of the piano is concerned, especially if you have lights come in. These even get polished here, all these pins. So we're going to spend that, uh, this week doing that, and uh, that's why I'd like to send the piano out following week, because that'll give us a chance to really make it exactly the way I want it before we send it out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. This gives you an idea of where we are at the piano, and I hope you have a good rest of the weekend. Thanks.